Welcome to the video on how to activate a link. So this will help with the shared community discussion area uh, where you want to include articles or videos um, in your posts so that colleagues can quickly reference these uh, resources. So what we mean by active link is if you take a look at these all these titles here in blue, they're all active because once you click on them, they'll take you to a specific link. So for instance, let's take a look at uh, the discussion area. Uh, you know what? I found a great article on uh, Pokemon Go and how uh, CRM efforts are being used with Pokemon Go. So I'm gonna I'm gonna click here under Understanding Service Products Consumer Markets. I'm gonna just start a new discussion topic, and my topic is gonna be about Pokemon Go CRM. And here, so you know what? I read the article. I've, 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 let's say, let's say I gave a great summary description of it, and now I want to say, well, here is the article. And usually, what people will do is they'll cut and paste uh, the URL from the article, and they'll leave it like that. Now, yes, you can copy and paste this, and you can put it into your uh, search engine, and you and you should get the article, but. It's not an active link. And what that means is you can see if I click on this, nothing's going to happen. So we want to make it an active link. We want to make it uh, easier for colleagues to go straight to the article. So what we do here is we simply select the, the URL. We're going we're gonna to go here. This is actually a link command button. Uh, and then we're going to enter the URL in here. Now once we do that, you see the difference now? It's in blue, and when I click on it, it will take me to uh, the article. Okay. Now, it's not necessary that you actually use the URL to use as a link. You can actually activate anything. You can activate a word. You can actually activate a picture. So, for instance, instead of having the URL in my postings, that isn't that neat. Um, it might be a little cumbersome. Let's just say uh, Pokemon article okay so now what I want is that I want colleagues to be able to click on this Pokemon article these specific words and then they should go to the link now right now obviously they can't do that because it's just written but we can do the same um, procedure we can go here to the link command put in the URL create a link and there you have it now it's in it's in blue it's active so when you create your postings, I really encourage you to use the active link, activating your link because it makes your postings much more approachable and it makes it easier for students or colleagues to access the information quickly. Thank you.